I mean, this is, is this the ultimate disrespect? <laughs> but uh, it doesn't really bother me. Where's my coffee? Parker needs coffee. <laughs> All right, let's do this. All right, Parker, you know, there's a lot of people that are actually worried this show is going to your head. I might be one of them, just, by the way. Yeah, you are, probably. Are you I'm just trying to mine some gold, you know? You know my parents, they won't let me get in yeah, your mom does much trouble. keep you uh, honest, doesn't she? Yeah. You know, we talked to some of your other family members, too, to see if they think you're uh, getting a little big for your britches. I wonder what they said. So, Nancy. Yes? I understand that you guys, you know, you and the family do a lot to try and keep Parker grounded, not get, like, an inflated ego. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's not every child's experience to be on TV. It's odd. At the very basis, it's very odd. I mean, Parker's a gold miner. He likes to gold mine. That's what he's doing. And so that part all feels fine. It's the attention that comes along with it. The camera crew following his every move can be disconcerting. All day long, Parker has a camera on him, pretty much. I mean, it's very rare that he's not being filmed. It's a huge issue for me, and it's a huge issue for Nancy to make sure that he stays down to earth and keeping him in a position where he is not getting cocky or big-headed to where he thinks he's better than anybody else. Parker's not better than anybody else. He's just had a lot of opportunities that others haven't. Like, yeah, I'm a, I guess I'm a punk ass kid doing whatever I want. Go ahead, hate me. I just came to say hi, but you're busy. Where's the gold? He's been placed in a very difficult situation. He has authority, independence, and he has a lot of people catering to him. And that gives him an independence that very few have. Yeah, look, you give him a lunch break, and what do you get? Steal all the donuts. I, I would never try to micromanage what he's doing up there. I would never insinuate that he needs to discuss those things with me. But things at home, like his bedroom, like dirt, that's still a mother-son issue. And he's not all that when it comes to those things.